I'm Ted Giovannis and I'm a driver. I had a healthcare consulting business that I operated and it just so happened during a litigation I was involved in, my wife had breast cancer which came back. I decided I needed to do something different. I decided to create my foundation. We wanted to move into the health space. That was when I initially ran into somebody at Hopkins and that was sort of the beginning of us wading into the breast cancer space. I'm not a mechanic. I'm not an engineer. It's those other disciplines that are driving a lot of our success. Cell biology is, I'm looking at that as no different. That's not my expertise. I have some organizational insights and sort of a macro view of health policy and where healthcare is going, which is really my space working with the Giovannis Institute. I am adopting a role that is right for me, realizing that I'm not Dr. Ewell. He is the one that's gonna drive these things. Cancer is the number two cause of death in Americans. And more than 90% of those deaths across all organ sites are attributable to metastasis. Metastasis is the process by which a tumor in one location is able to shed cells that travel through the body to form new tumors in distant vital organs. Formula One is the pinnacle of motor racing in the world. They have tons of data. It allows them to construct mathematical models. They can change a part in the data and then run a complete simulation of a race to see if the part's gonna fail. It's trying to understand and trying to improve how fast we can discover. It's very similar to what we do in research. There's an amazing opportunity to collect large amounts of data and bring incredible computational and mathematical resources to bear to understand how does the cell work on its own, how does the cell work within the tumor, and how do we intervene to prevent and treat metastasis. Philanthropic support of Johns Hopkins has been key since day one of our existence. This transforming gift for basic science and cell biology is an extrapolation or is a continuation of that legacy. We have a lot to be thankful for in Ted Giovannis. Mr. Giovannis's investment is transformative for our ability to work not only in breast cancer metastasis, but to work to identify common biology of metastasis across organ sites. The way it's structured as we let it evolve can lead to good things. It's a structure that allows input. It's a structure that allows change in direction. So it can add disciplines, it can do what it needs to do. The last 10 years of research have convinced me that metastasis is a solvable problem. We can understand how it works, identify specific opportunities for therapeutic intervention, and we can improve lives for patients.